llamas and alpacas. This is Livy, and welcome back to another episode of Alpaca <laughs> Power. Now, I've been really, really excited about this one because we're going to be talking about the top 10 alpaca Japanese game shows. If you know me very, very well, you will know that I just absolutely love the Japanese culture, anime, manga, kawaii, lolita, and especially the Japanese pavilion at Walt Disney World in Epcot. Oh my god, guys. And, mmm, Pocky, gotta have my Pocky. Yummy. One of the things that Japan is really well known for is having these really bizarre game shows. But did you know that some of them only have to do with alpacas? So, this is the list where we talk about the top 10 alpaca Japanese game shows. And I am not alone. I am here with Hot Lol from the Joy Charge Gamers. And he's actually going to start it off. With this countdown. Number 10, Alpaca Mellow. This show is where alpacas are hooked to a bungee cord to the wall as they walk to try and eat marshmallows and ooh, that looks painful. And those faces, what is this? <laughs> you don't see me trying that, kids. Number 9, Shear the Paca. Now, all you see first is a dancing female alpaca behind these blocks. And these male alpacas who are sheared try to climb this slippery walkway or whatever it is and throw bean bags at the blocks to, to knock it down and see a little bit of a sheared female alpaca. Yeah, that's basically it. And they have to run up and Whoever gets the most wins. At least that's how I believe it works. Number eight. Shears what happens. An alpaca has to sing karaoke. Well, it's wolves being sheared of. And what am I even looking at? What, what is that? What is that? No. No. Number seven. Alpaca bath. Now, this is where... An alpaca in a bikini tries to walk on these bars above a bath of boiling hot water. While there's other ones trying to tease it by like, you know, making funny faces. And especially some of them have drawn on moustaches or fake on moustaches. But try to get her to knock over. And sometimes they just push her and just knocks her over in the bath in the hot bath. Ouch. Do you remember when the hot water bucket challenge was a thing? I actually don't either. Number six, alpaca or llama. In this show, people walk around the room feeling uh, if things are alpacas or llamas. It's, it's, it's weird. How can you even feel the difference? Is there a fluffy difference? What, what are you doing here? Don't touch it there! What's wrong with you? Number five, don't move alpaca! Now what this one is, it's a whole group of female alpacas and they all um, have these ping pong balls in their mouth and helmets and they have to be in a very, very strange position like, you know, standing on one foot, posing weirdly, whatever, and and there will be like somebody walking around them making funny faces or have some other animals walk near them. No matter how disgusting or how scary or how funny it is, they cannot move. If they do, they are simply out. Sounds like an intense game of alpaca red light green light or red llama green llama. Number four, Paca Slide. What? Why? What? What? No! Why would you? Okay, moment, moment. Pretty much an old that llama that is shaved naked gets old up and gets to slide over a line of young alpacas in bikinis. Why? I don't know. Why am I doing this? Oh dear. And if he doesn't make it, he gets bonked on the head and he has to crawl his way back across. I feel sorry for the younger llamas. This llamas, I meant alpacas. 
And my brain is fried from this. <laughs> Number three, the tail game. Now, there's this whole group of male alpacas, and then they see this little hole, and out that little hole is two tails. Well, there's two holes, and there's a tail out of one hole. But, and each one has to pick a tail. And I don't know if they, like, bite at it, or chew at it, or lick it. I don't know what they do. But, at the end, then they reveal whether they were playing with a tail of a llama or an alpaca. Oh, you should see the faces of the llamas that found out that they were doing it with an alpaca. Well, that sounded wrong. No, no way! Don't judge me! Don't get your mind out of the gutter. That's what I was looking for. Ah! Can't talk today. Number two, a alpaca. Very famous alpaca called APL48. And, well, they just work together with the show to do weird stuff where pretty much they're trying to blow things into each other's mouth. Sometimes it's a slice of apple or something else. And other times it's just, ooh, you don't want to feed that to an alpaca. They will get gassy. And the alpaca gas is not good for you. And number one, alpaca in a box. Now, this one. Is so cute. It's these group of alpacas and they have to put their hand in a box and the other alpacas can see what's in the box but the alpaca who's putting the hand in the box can't. Like it could be something really like every day or it could be something absolutely disgusting. Is it a spider or is it a baby doll? Whatever it is they have to touch it and they have to guess and sometimes when they freak out even if it's over nothing it, it is just so funny it is just so funny so these are our top 10 alpaca game shows Japanese alpaca game, game shows oh my god oh, I'm just so excited about this project and thank you again for Kotlaw for helping me out with this top 10 and if you want to check out Droid Charge Gamers, I'll leave their description, I mean their, um, oh my god, I can't even talk, their channel link in the description below, and I'll also put Kotlaw's Twitter in there so you can tweet him, tell him I sent you, tell him I say hi, he's a very fun guy to talk to, very fun guy to hang out with, he's just a fun guy, period, and, and we tease each other a lot, or actually he more teases me a lot. <laughs> But I don't care. It's all for fun. But hit the like button. Very well appreciated. Hop aboard that alpaca bandwagon and subscribe. Hit the bell for notification. Um, also, make sure to check out my social medias if you want. But this was Livy, and this had been Livy Next. I'll see you next time, my friends. See ya!